Ghana is trying to save an endangered monkey species from extinction. The white nape mangabe lives in some parts of West Africa, and conservationists are worried their habitats are under threat due to human activity. They want the government to step up efforts to protect the endangered primates. QUTN's Nabil Ahmed Rafai reports from Accra. The mangabees are considered endangered. 26 of them are being protected at the zoo in Accra after their natural habitat was destroyed. Their population have been threatened to the extent that they are almost critically endangered and if nothing is done about them, they might go extinct. Wildlife officials attribute the reduction in population of the mangabe monkeys in Ghana to human activities like deforestation and mining. Some of them are being bred here with plans to reintroduce them back into the wild. And that is why we've done that enrichment in the cages to feel as if they are in the wild, so that when we are moving them back into the wild, it becomes much more simpler and easier because at least we have been able to mimic the environment for them. The white-nipped mangabe monkeys were largely found in Ghana, Burkina Faso and Cote d'Ivoire, but they are now very rare and can only be found in a few forests. According to the United Nations, about one million species of wildlife are on the brink of extinction. For many tourists, this is a rare opportunity to have an up-close encounter with endangered animals. It's something they say they will cherish for a lifetime. Activists say more needs to be done to protect the wildlife. They believe it starts by raising awareness and educating people on why it is important to conserve endangered species. We want to inculcate the habits, the habit of um, loving the animals so that they themselves will know how to protect and conserve them and also um, check people when they are doing things wrongly to these wild animals. As these mangabe monkeys find a temporary home at the zoo, officials hope once they are returned to their natural habitat, their numbers could increase. Nabil Ahmed Rufai, CGTN, Accra, Ghana.